This video is sponsored by Wing Wing Technology, your ultimate fly sim hardware solution. Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing wonderfully well. For today's valued viewer requested mission, we've got from Haunted Pancake. Operation Red Herring High Cap. I've got another fun mission for you in the Reapers. A fictional Russian air attack on Denmark's east coast in 1985. I called Operation Red Herring. Now, Denmark might not be known as a military superpower. It's not. But back then, they could have made things difficult for Ivan. That's the Russians. Should he have tried something not cricket? At the exit of the Baltic, they had four escadrilles with hawks. Each squadron had six ramps with three missiles per ramp, totaling some 72 missiles ready to go. Guided for long-range air radar set. Was that true? I actually did some research. Apparently, that's, that's what they had at the time for the SAMs, yeah. Very good. All of this was backed up by an airbase with hardened shelters for at least 12 F-16s. In real life, the Hawk squadrons were placed along the coast with a pair of two in the south and the other two spaced with about 35 kilometers 20 miles between them so they could cover each other two plus one plus one if you want to be the mighty soviet air force trying to crush the capitalists or the plucky underdog danes it's up to you good luck and have fun matt dk so welcome to operation red herring 1985 starscream send all right, so our fictional mission for today, 1984, I kind of provide a little bit more background for why uh, why the Soviets are attacking uh, Danish SAM sites. So uh, currently, the Soviet offensive in the fall to gap Germany has stalled out. Um, so major operations between those sides are going on there. So the Soviet Navy desperately needs to have a victory in the Atlantic before the Americans can continue to reinforce the forces in uh, in Europe. So to do that, they want to get their Baltic fleet out and into the Atlantic. But to do that, the problem is, is that the Danes, and I, I added this here, I don't know if they actually had land-based harpoon sites, which happen to look a lot like uh, silkworms, uh, are on the coast and will prevent the Soviet fleet from making it through um, the small gap between uh, Sweden and Denmark um, and out into the uh, out into the Atlantic. So, uh, so to, let's see here, um, let's see here. Uh, to accomplish uh, this, they invaded the island of Bornholm. I think I'm saying that correct. Uh, two days ago, and they have staged the strike force there with uh, both fighter aircraft and bomber aircraft, which is where we're going to be today, even with our Soviet AWACS. And the fleet is headed towards Denmark to try to make it through. And of course, they'll use their air power to also help uh, support this mission. The Danish have 12 F-16s, which apparently is the exact amount of F-16s they had defending their uh, east coast at the time. Don't pay attention to the map. Uh, we're just in reverse. So instead of headed Hello. out, we're, uh, we're, we're headed out the other Hello. way. Let's see here. They also have a flight of Mirages and F-4 Phantoms coming both from both France and Germany to assist in the defense because obviously the rest of the NATO members know that if the Soviet Baltic fleet gets out to the Atlantic, it's one more thing that they have to deal with. Four parts to this. Uh, seed aircraft need to go in there and destroy the SAM sites. The SAM sites are waypoints 3, 4, 5, and 6. Um, our main objective, though, is the Hawk batteries, which are waypoint 1 and 2. And it should be programmed into all of the aircraft, so that way you know what you're going to. Um, the one problem I've noticed is that some FC-3 uh, aircraft only only able to do waypoints up to like waypoint five so that might be a problem but it, but most of the fc3 aircraft are going to be doing attack on the uh, waypoint one and two so that shouldn't be a problem we need to have cap fighters that are flying overhead to protect from the f-16s that are going to be scrambling to take off and intercept us and also if any german or french fighters happen to arrive from the south to try to help support the danes and also, up to the north there, you will see that we have Swedish airspace. It says, do not enter. If you enter Swedish airspace, which is if you get to the coast of uh, that area that's north of us, um, the Swedes will launch aircraft to intercept us. And then that's one more thing we have to deal with. So make sure that you uh, don't enter that area up there. Don't go up into, into that. Try to stay into the open water and continue to go forward. Uh, so pretty self-explanatory seed go up destroy the sams cap intercept the fighters ground attack attack the harpoon batteries and after the har harpoon batteries go ahead attack the sam sites and completely destroy them the the secondary objective is way up there uh at the north um 
most nor- ah, I can't talk most northern airfield has a, uh, a an entire Danish mechanized uh, battalion that's going to be shipped out to uh, help the Germans. So if we can destroy any of that to help our our brothers that are fighting for the uh, motherland down in the Falda Gap, then they can uh, you know do that. If you want to go ahead and go to Intel, it shows uh, pictures that we have from our Soviet spies uh, on the ground of what these things look like. So the first one there is your harpoon batteries. As you can see, they're right next to the shore. They're equipped with launchers and a CP. Then we have our Hawk batteries. They do only have one track radar. So I, I someone helped me here. I think that track radar then can only track one aircraft at a time. Though previous experience, that doesn't stop them from shooting multiple missiles at the one target. So if you happen to be the one target, a lookout because they do have the, the total six launchers, which is the, the 72 missiles or whatever that... Uh, that was uh, cited for the mission. And at the very bottom there, we have the mechanized battalion that is at the northern airport. Realize that uh, all the air, the blue airports do have one stinger team that is present at them. So if you do try to attack any of the airports, um, just realize that there is a stinger. Uh, this, uh, this airport seems to have a stinger team that's usually stationed on the northern end of uh, the operations area. So... Uh, if we can take him out, that makes it easy. But obviously, if we're having a bunch of aircraft attack this all at the same time, one Stinger team can only fire one missile at a time. Are there any questions? Do we know if there are any AAA-style air defenses uh, with the Hawk batteries? Wow. Negative. They are. They are. Their their defense is the Hawk sites. They might have a small security element with them, either like uh, some Humvees with machine guns, one one threes, or something like that, just to protect them from. Uh, spies or saboteurs from causing damage to them overnight but other words they are relatively unprotected from anything else uh restrictions are pretty self-explanatory no we're having f-18s stand in for uh mig 27s so they can do the seed uh no am 120s am 9x's jdm's jb gbu's uh, the harriers are acting as yak 38s which in, in my perfect world someday we'll have a Yak-38 in DCS that we can vertical take off for the Soviets, the Reds. But uh, obviously no JDAMs or GBUs. And, you, and the Yak-38s only had two pylons per wing. So oh. so Harriers, you're restricted to two pylons, whatever, whatever that is that you want. If you do notice here, the map is relatively small. The fly from, from Kish over to where we're going to be attacking and back isn't very much. It's very possible, especially to seed aircraft. You go in there, you launch your missiles. Go back, rearm, and uh, and take back off again. So, because there's plenty of stuff to bomb, and there's plenty of fighters to take down. Roger. In fact, um, hopefully there's Roger, not. Hopefully uh, there's not too many fighters. I'm finding it very cunningly put put together map. It does look just like Denmark and pretty much where Sweden is. So that's uh, that's quite clever. Okay, guys. Um, I'm gonna go through the teams, and then we can do some more tactics. Dragon is cap escort MiG 29 A's. Uh, we've got Comrade Seahorse, Jigsaw, and Red Panther. Uh, naval fulcrums, cover and penguin from the Kuznetsov. Uh, Python, MiG-21 slash MiG-28, those Soviet dark fighters, uh, Hillary only. Boa are MiG-25s, okay, we'll go with that. MiG-25 Foxbats, Grump. Well, the one, one yes. of the reasons I did them is because they have the, R, was it R-33, yes. that giant ocean was- yeah, I was going to ask about that if we're just simulating the uh, Phoenixes as R-33s. Pretty similar. That's that's exactly what you're doing. And you can fly high and fast, so that's the closest thing to a MiG-25 yeah. we got. Very good. Yeehaw. Grump, Whistler, and Skill. Panther, SU-25s. Wow, our SU-25s. Starscream, B and L-O. Brilliant fighters. Brilliant planes they are. Uh, Lyron is SU-25Ts, so the, the SEAD variants. Tuxorb like Brinks. Tiger Yak 38s uh, in the guise of AV8B, Cypher RC, Cat Patina RT. Diamondback is empty, MiG 19s, a shame. And Hydra is Bogs. Oh, and okay, the Bogs are going to be MiG 27s today. That should be interesting. AGM 88 is your KH 29 MP anti radiation missile. So that's how the, how we're getting by that. That's fine, guys. Um, regarding how we're going to do this, what do you want the Harriers doing today? Are we going to task particular sort of subflights yep. with particular waypoints? I would suggest rather than they all attack the same one. Yep, sounds great. Um, do you want the Harriers on the Harpoon batteries? Because we're not going to be much good against standoff Hawks. 
So why don't Harriers go for waypoint one harpoons? And if we do that successfully, we can go for waypoint two harpoons. But let's go to waypoint one harpoons, yeah? I was just about to ask about the waypoints. Uh, did you say that the... Uh... I'm pretty sure you mixed them the other way around in the uh, the briefing. You said waypoint three, four, five, and six were the harpoons. You said the hawk sites were one and oh. two. You you got it the other way oh. around in the map. I, I'm sorry. It? Yeah, my it's my uh, it's my Sam slash anti ship dyslexia. Mm. And uh, and yes, the so that the hawk it says it's written there on the map. The hawks are the Sams are three, four, five, six, which are actually spaced out to twenty miles exactly the way it was. The, the way they really were, and then the harpoon batteries are one and two because the harpoon batteries are the are theoretically the the main objective, right? Is that so we can get the Soviet fleet through here and out into the Atlantic, and without without anti ship missiles, then they can easily go through. But we can't really get close enough to them unless we take out the Sams. Since I'm a sort of Harrier, not starting on the carrier, I quite fancied the idea of trying a long range sidewinder, a thirty mile shot. Uh, from 30,000 feet to see if I can take out uh, one of the uh, uh, Hawk batteries. Hold up. I don't for that not side. <laughs> means side, okay. side arm. Okay, Moderati, um, you do that, uh, but the rest of us... I'll go, go for six. I'll try six. All right, the rest of us will go together for the uh, for the, for the harpoon... Uh, you're not going to say the harpoons, the silkworms. Um, Hydra, that's the 27 floggers, or F-18s. Do you guys... Which Sams do you want to go for, southern or north? Take all of them, can we? <laughs> no, there you go. Um, in that case, Lion, are you just going to go for everything as well? They're ground attack only, aren't they? So. Well, it says there's... Oh, how about that? Ground attack. Right, okay. Um, that's it. That's Problem. me done. Anything else? Any more to add? And what nozzle? Um, in all honesty, if we just go full, um, full aft, you should be good. Uh, with the ski jump, you should get uh, chucked into the air enough to get away with it. Okay. Yes, I'll go for the back of the ship, that gives you the best chance. I'm just going to have the nozzles pushing me like forward and then bring them kind of down a little bit as we go off the ramp. Yeah, I'm going to play by Ian, honestly. I'm sure we'll get away with it. Make sure you set your ECM to receive. Not transmit. Negative. Set it to receive, and it will auto transmit when you it, uh, it gets pixeling up. Check, checking it. Roger, thank you. At uh, what waypoint we're we heading to? Out of interest, guys. Uh, Pony waypoint one should be harpoons. Yep. Are you ready for us to take off? Yeah, everyone take off a wheel, um, guys. See so you flat right, comrade. Up go the Sukhois. Yeah, RT 154420. Copy. Oh, I like your thinking. Alright, bricks on. Let's pull them up. Why would we wait for anybody? I do not wish to go to Gulag. Hey, who are we waiting for?
Full Melon breaks off in three, two, ah, let's go. Oh, I can't read this. It's all in Imperial. Uh, let's say we take off now. Rumpnik is airborne. Say what's in the EW, valued humans. Zap. Oh, hello. Top late, top late, top late, top late, top late. Unknown. Can't remember. F-18, by which I mean MiG-27. Artificial with the ships. Soviet AWACS and a clamshell. A big bird. Oh my goodness gracious me. Take off in your time. Taken up. Don't screw this up, Cap. No one wants to see you screw this up. Right. Full power, full power, full power. Yeah, tiny amount of nozzle, that's all I used. Yes, you're not screwing up. Power, 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 uh oh, uh oh, we got it, we got it. Nothing happened. Bloody out, Cap. Oh, it's all good. You like you came with the side of the map there. Yeah, turns out you need, do need nose steering. Come on, come on. My uh, nose wheels failed to come up. <laughs> yeah, same here. <laughs> Long. Long. Where's that the lead? ramp is not good for the nose wheel. Where's the lead? Yeah, it's not. We, it's the wrong angle for us. Where's the lead gone? That's out. Have you got into? I'm following you. Check. I am so sorry. So sorry about that. Why are you? Good thing I've changed the channel. That was me. I, I can't, could not stop rolling at that line. Uh, 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 eight o'clock. <laughs> Just responded. That's why I like you, comrade. Oh, oh, it takes the heat off the rest of us. Don't worry, we'll cut that one out. Half one time. Uh, no, we definitely don't cut that one out. Oh. Lee, do you get your flaps down? Like full. No, there should be an auto. Like nose, gears, nose gears down. Probably. It's going to be a slow trip, but all right. Um, we're both here. I switched to cruise and it forced them up. After I'm going to head for waypoint six, but I'll uh, try not to get too far ahead of the uh, pack so as I don't trigger the uh, cap response. Hopefully, this is.
doesn't have any unforeseen consequences in the motion chip. Mmm. Like your wheels, weight on wheels, Spencer? Yep. We're still over 500 knots, so that's not too bad. Get your ass to Mars. It's going to make an interesting thumbnail. It does. Yes, it does. Of course, now we know to take off the back of the crustacean off. Mm. Yep. What's now with the teapot? Floris, I don't understand what I R I A F mean. Uh, Infinitrable Russian Incredible Air Force. Haha! <laughs> Skrupnik gets it. Problem is, uh, our weird landing gear is blocking the teapot view. Whoops! Yep. Way off to you seem to be heading completely the wrong direction. Ah, what a surprise. It's deliberate. Okay, that's fine. Artie has his ways. Oh, what's that? Is that pickles? Are you sure pickles? Definitely pickles? Okay pickles. That's a lot of RWR returns boys. It's fine. Just to be ready. UK is probably our target, so I'd imagine that's uh, a known, maybe a circle of battery. Yeah, they definitely have a radar. Um, what we'll try and do is, uh, lead go for the left targets, me the right targets, 
to the middle target so we don't send missiles in the same thing. Yeah, hopefully we're going to be able to get some eyes on it while we're still at range with my team but I'm doing sort of angled approach to try and get myself some eyes and see what the nature of the targets are. when I saw the 29 behind us, but uh, that's friendly, isn't it? Mm-hmm. You, well, we don't know if we can get friendly fired yet, but it is the Grim Reapers. <laughs> Big-ass cons above us, and I want to have a look at them on a the car, because I'm going to crash. Just can't wait for some yeah. of the comments on the video. Sea <laughs> flankers above us. One for the Harriers. What are you in? I'm 18. What's your favourite? Yeah. Figured I'd come. Didn't fancy a challenge. Not today. It's just spiked by a 409. A 109? That's a ship. Yeah, that's worrying. I'm seeing contrails in that direction, so they're probably spiking in those things. Yep. Oh, I see the land, I see the land. Right, I'm gonna space out and get my, get my uh, stuff ready. My God! Spike F-16 and three times Hawks. Not good. At least the fighters are in front. Yeah, I'm seeing three uh, targets on the ground at a command station. As we go, uh, I'll take left one. Number two, take centre. Number three, take right. Tally F-16. Well, we've got plenty of cover between us and them. I think that might be the F-16 uh, 11 o'clock high, conning. Preparing to run like hell. We've got Penguin, uh, we've got several SU-33s between us and them. Yeah, yeah they're turning him back. They're turning him back. Go and get him, boys. Yeah, they're shooting him, they're shooting him. Come on, get him. Splash, he's down, he's down. Alright, back to work. Let's see which one you go after, the right one. Uh, I think I'm starting to get set 
Caps on the right, caps on the right. Brooklyn head, to positive identification. Target uh, 56 miles out, 135. Group Nick Fox 3. Yeah. Start looking at us now. Group Nick go defensive now. Oh, Defensive Hawk, couldn't get a lock. I'm going to turn the coast and see if we can do anything about that Hawk. Pull up, pull up. Pull up, pull up. Cup safe. Recommitting. Seven miles. Shark going in for BDA. Surrounded by F-16s, guys. You guys see that? Anyone with Cap Squad left alive? Yes, I still here. F-16s in front, F-16s behind. Not a good look. I'm probably twisting with our Hulk side, trying to take it out back. Flash! 
Grubnik splash one. Six o'clock low. Drop next, splash two. Why did Bandit not go boom? We shoot missile Bandit go boom. Absolute uh, cap, do we have any support to keep us alive please? We've got F-16s in the next. Uh, Bandit is engaging F-16s, splash two. Roger. Peace. Peace. I'm doing the last shot now, it will be dead in one minute and then we need to get our new orders. Roger, I will push waypoint two next. Rifle. Roger, pushing waypoint two. Come on, give Supercap boom boom. Give Supercap his beloved boom boom, please. That's the boom boom. Going by point two. 25 miles away. There's a hawk there as well, so be aware. Yeah. Are you able to do that? Yeah, I'm gonna consume. Yeah, good, notch. Second missile out, probably for me. Running in. Good luck. Comrade, splash one. Good splash, comrade. I, did, I do believe I see that on my screen. There we go. Oh, he's coming straight at me. Do it, baby, do it. Target, 22 miles. Spike on our nose, 12 o'clock. Just 16 shooting at me. He's on our nose, Spike, 12 o'clock. Missile, missile, 12 o'clock. Grumpsy, uh... Ah, break right. Fuel joker. Look like, uh, uh, Fox 1. Shit, Spike, 11 o'clock. Launch, 12 o'clock. Hot. Break left. Switching to PSTT. Bandit. Phantom. 12 o'clock. Two miles. A uh, what? Lots of luck. 12 o'clock low. Splash. Got him. Grumpnik. Uh, splash one. 7 o'clock high. Splash two. Rupnik Fox 1 on F4. Oh, this be good splash there, there comrade. Rupnik splash 2.
down. You got the hawk. Unknown, I'll see. Oh, did it get him? Yeah, we're hit. If you're not got a harm, you can send after I'll see. Yeah, I've already sent my harms off. Alright, well I can't have that many missiles, I'm going to have a look at him. How many missiles can you have, boys? I'm over it. Just trying to take it out of the guns. It's in the way. What's fired? What's fired? What's fired? What's fired? I don't know. I'm not sticking around to find out. I'm fired on evasive. Uh, I'm down. God damn it. Invaded. Running in. Something's going on over there. Right, don't go high, don't go high. And have a shot, have a shot. Go on. Got it. Was that you with the guns? Nice! Let's go and polish it off! Yeah, I see the tracking. His track radar is down, so he's good. Right, what have we got here, little piggies? Gotcha! Kept locking up and preparing to fire. Up rifle. Cap rifle. Harpoon sight. Alright. Uh, you shoot the to get the track radar? Negative, I just killed two harpoons. Uh, but okay, I'm Winchester now. I've got a gun pod, brilliant. Right. Done. See the rifle. Okay, I'm coming in with guns. Coming in, 25 mil Gatling gun, let's see what you've got, baby. Running in.
for someone to help. I'll see you can help. I don't think I can. Uh, maybe I can. I can damage. But maybe if you can be bothered, I'll see. Ah. Uh, I'm not functioning. I'm not working. Coming back around. The SAM site's finished, going to have a look at the last of the Harpoon site. Hey guys, that's two harpoon sites down and a SAM site down. Excellent work, RTB please. shooting ever. Pull up, pull up. Zero. How do we get back home? I guess we just got to use the tendencies. Roger, what was the vector? For me, it's about 294 for 17 miles. Roger, let's go. Hurry up, power! Oh, we had our lights on. How about that? Cap, you're looking at about 290 for your head. Oh, I found it, max 0.95. Comrade, cover now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, to be in that Recommend mode. you break off. Incoming Fox 3s. Roger. What's your fuel to? Telekinetic net's off. Okay, Harry, uh, carriers, 20 miles in those. Which one are we landing on? Uh, I think it's the right side one we took up from. The right from this angle. Um, when you're looking at the carriers from the back, we'll be on the right side one. So it'll be the one closest to us, I imagine. Spiked by a Mirage 2000. 
Well, we don't have any of those, so that's problematic. True altitude, Cap. Sorry. Oh, yeah, I see you right above me. How's your fuel? Uh, 2.7. I'm going to go for a supersonic dive. Get this bucket through the sound barrier. Yeah, my fuel's at 0.5, so I'm going to try and land on the carrier. Hey boys, let's get this baby cooking. Act 9.97. We're the gun pod and uh, EW pod. 0 0.98. Push, push, push. Come on. 0 0.99. Do it. No, that's not supersonic. Come on, push. Yes! Not quite. Why are you so hard to get supersonic? Ah, damn it, giving up. Couldn't quite get supersonic. Whereabouts are you two? I'm just off your 8 o'clock ish now, Captain. Where are you? Oh, I see you. Why, well, they save our gear work. Did Cypher get shot down? Yeah, I'm going for the classic old Harrier 500 knot approach. Oh, I see you. Your lights are extra bright. Get that reported. It is. I think we should report the fact that uh, our landing gear breaks when we take off from the Chris next job. Probably not, because it probably would break. Because uh, that's something we always do with Harriers. Oh God, I don't know, what do you think I'll see? Yeah, it's not going to get reported. Our oh, says no. You can always put it on the forum. Yeah, I'll get right on that. All comrades, all flight of MiG 25s inbound for home. We are dry on weapons and fuel. Okay, point two. More than you. Comrades, glorious MiG 29K RTB the boat. Landed here. Landed here. Landed here. Glory be to us today. I've got the landing gear down, woman. I don't know if I can land it on here the first time. That's all I got. Landed here. Landed here. Landed here. Landed here. Landed here. Landed here, landed here. Landed here, landed here. Landed here, landed here. Oh, but it got them out to ground mode, no wonder. There we go. Whoops. I was using the wrong lever. Embarrassing for me. Landed here, landed here. Landed here. Okay, turning base. Landed. A few minor control problems. Everything else is fine. Landed here. Brilliant. Something's chased us down. Sure. Said 10 and the My favorite. Glorious Never landed this thing on you before. No fuel. Oh, that didn't work. Uh oh. You owe me an airframe, I should have done my loop. Going for 
Alright, one more try. God damn it, just get down on the deck. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, we're okay. We're okay. Nothing happened. Ah, there we go, beautiful. Ah. Have done. Uh, engine's dead. We're not gonna make it. Oh, that wasn't very awesome. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll make sure everyone's watching. Oh, there he is. Uh, so close. Oh, dearie me. Caution, caution. Somebody just got shot down. Storm 30, 30. Caution, caution. Oh yeah, there's a Mirage 2000 surrounding the, uh, flying around the, uh, fleet. Haha, <laughs> that's problematic. Oh, I missiles are going up. Uh, you won't yeah. be there for long. Oh, ships are gonna get it. Oh, here he comes. He's coming to shoot two down. Oh, does the visage! <laughs> you got cocky, Mr. Danish. Be up, shut down. All units, magic now, sunrise. Uh, any air to air capable tar uh, aircraft available at this time? AWACS is under attack. Nah, we're all RDB. AWACS can go suck a lemon. Actually, under the data link on mission, you can go and get shot down. Hello, pig. Hey, you act smart. You just fly into the fleet. Will the comments sort of? Jigsaw, comrade, how copy you? Uh, we're about to be shot down if you want to uh, shoot something for out of the sky. Give me a direction. Intercept will be uh, 202 for 33, three, Angels 27. Target is hot. 20. Target is capital Big F4. Target now 199 for 27. Uh oh. Angels 2 2. Oh, they have fired on us. So much for the AWACS. They got what they deserve. Fuck so. No mercy for traitors, comrade. They have a group that like to see things get shut down. So, I'm going for Kish 09 left.
Okay, guys, um, let's talk about uh, what went on. Can I have the... Uh, I don't suppose we have a, do we have a Game Master's report on that, or do we not know how much stuff was blown up? No, the, the Game Master was just uh, flying SU-25, so I guess we have... Okay, well, let's I go guess. first group send, please. I guess uh, we had some troubles with taking off, so one crashed into RC. Ooh. And um, basically, we had a hard time to find enemy targets, and yep, RTB. What airplanes were there? I think we he just crossed the runway as we took off. Oh, drop. Yeah, I uh, I was <laughs> trying to stop and I could. It was an F eighteen with brakes, you know. Next group send. Too fast. Uh, that's Panther Flight. It was me and Penguin and our trusty MiG twenty nine Ks quotes. Uh, took off, joined up in the middle of the strike package as we discussed, and then uh, we each shot down four and landed nice. back on the Kuznetsov. What you been sorry? If what? Uh, we were in the MiG 29Ks, aka the SU 33. Watch out. Well done, guys. Uh, next group. Did we, actually have, did we actually have uh, Python there? Negative. Okay, so next would be BOA. That would be the MiG 25s. Uh, so, aside from Grupnik uh, talking in a uh, terrible Russian accent the entire time, uh, we took off from uh, Kish or. Born home, uh, and then we went over to Waypoint 1. That's when we started seeing all the F-16s coming in. I uh, know uh, I shot down four aircraft. There was uh, two F-16s and two F-4s. I uh, know the skill got, uh, you got, what, three kills as well? Yeah, two F-16s, one Mirage. There you go. Um, and then Whistler, you shot down at least two, yeah? Yes, one F-4 and one F-16. There you have it. And then uh, after that, most of us were Joker Fuel and RTB. I somehow got shot down by a Mirage over home base. <laughs> um, so that was a thing. Uh, so uh, that would be the only airframe loss from our flight. Well done, guys. I was actually really good cap. I was just watching you just taking things out. Uh, well done. Next flight send. That is Panther and her SU-25s. Uh, myself and Bean took off. Uh, we made sure to go um also, i'm sorry and also elo was in there we took off we made sure to stay behind uh the cap flight um but the uh the small naval units that i have up there to the north which and all the testing were way out of range uh were shooting a plethora of sm2s at us i dodged at least three myself i think bean dodged one i don't i don't know what happened at elo we lost him at some point uh, yeah you uh in a run-in oh are you okay yeah. And we came in running, and we uh, we pretty much demolished the target. And then we took off to fly back. Bean, I don't know if you want to tell about what happened to you. Uh, well, yeah, I mean, I <laughs> I got hit by Stinger on the target. But even though I was on fire, the trusty SC-25, I managed to turn around and uh, still make another rocket pass before having to eject. It's good fun. I'm a bit toasty now. Uh, Jesus, Cypher was merged with two F-16s through his fight. I was merged with one. Uh, Next group, send. The 25Ts, uh, Blight, Brinks, and I, we followed the other SU-25s, and then Blight got shot down by a ship missile, anti -sh or a SAM missile from a ship, or and then Tuxor got sniped out of this plane or something. And then I'm coming back after shooting down a Huey and then dodging a bunch of Sams. Watch out. Next group, send. Okay, that would be the Javiers. So uh, we, we discovered that the Connects off isn't necessarily the best choice for launching with the Javier, and we all went out with a dangling front end. Um, we got to the target area. Uh, two and three got diverted due to being fired on by F-16s and the Hawk. I dived in, took out a couple of the Tomahawks, um, I then diverted and uh, shredded the local hawk site with my guns while the uh, two and three finished off the initial harpoon. I then progressed towards the second harpoon site, uh, dodged the incoming missiles from the hawk, only to discover there was an F-16 on my arse and uh, who um, aim 9 peed me in the bomb, so I died. We did well. We took out uh, two harpoon sites and two uh, hawk sites, which is not that easy with three Harriers. So I'm chuffed with that. Yeah. Most of the time, merged with Falcons that we didn't even know about. 
I took off from Kish, uh, deliberately went south so I could come in a sort of uh, uh, 090 heading on the waypoint uh, 6 and waypoint 5 hawk sites. Uh, but without waypoints, uh, my technique of uh, standoff sidewinders didn't really work, so they all missed. And uh, anyway, the Hawk radars were taken out by, I think, Rubicon with AGM 88 before I got there. So my targets were gone. So I went in, tried to get with guns, uh, but got too slow and uh, ended up in the drink. Roger. Roger. Okay, guys, um, attack view ended there. Um, next group, if there is one, I can't remember. Wildcat, wow. Uh, oh. Seed flight. Mm -hmm. uh, we, <laughs> we, it went lovely. Yes, yeah, perfect. We definitely didn't die to silly circumstances. Go on. Uh, I, we took out loads of the Hawk sites, as promised. I got three radars out of four missiles. Mm. Uh, I think Space Chef got three. I don't have a Ruby. Ruby, how many did you get? Come on, Ruby. Is it? Yeah. It's ignoring you. Oh, it's you know, it's understandable. Mm. And then I saw something weird out of my window, and I was like, "What the hell is that? It looked like something smoking, but it's like a very short smoke trail." Mm. Turns out it was named Nine P off her sixteen. Ooh, so that was zap. Yep. Dog aim. And uh, mm -hmm. yeah, I should have just gone back to base like Space Chef did. You probably should have. Those F sixteen A's are dogfighting. They're a nightmare. Um, Okay, well, at least you did something with your lives before you got blown up. Uh, any other groups? Okay, I'm relatively happy, guys. It looks like we shot down, I don't know, maybe 12 aircraft, uh, six or seven SAM sites taken down, uh, all of the Harpoon sites taken down, the frogs did whatever damage the frogs did before they got shot down by the SM2s, and maybe half of us returned to base, which for Grim Reapers is a small miracle. Anyone, um, good mission from Starscream, as ever, always seems to get the right balance of fun and seriousness and everything, um, so that's great. Anything before I get to work? Capitalists feel the pain today. Yes, they do. Denmark down. Sweden next. Right, guys, I'll catch you later. Take care.